folks, welcome back to some more Pokemon Legends Arceus. Yes, I got Gabite with me. Pretty much just a level up just to get the card chomp. Just nothing. Nothing special there. Let's just move on. Still got Chase on, uh... Shit, I don't remember what her name is. Oh, goody, Reggie's nice, uh... Nice to be here. Yeah. Oh, great bong songs here, too. Don't mind me. Um... Okay, Karen. Where is she's upstairs? Hey, man. Ray, where are you gonna go? I don't know, man. I should go, go wherever. I think he's telling me to ow. Oh, damn it. Oh, boy. Let's see if I can find this sorry girl. Who wants to play fucking hide and seek? Yes, yeah, so I gotta follow these guys. Follow the statues, and you'll find where you need to go. Oh, goody, what is this? <laughs> Three traces, yeah. Hold <laughs> on a second. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> I don't think that really matters. Okay, press the rock one. Eyes. And then steal. Okay, let me read this then. <clears throat> Apparently, there's a card into it. Okay. Statue's gaze. Whether the statue's gaze? Whether the statue's gaze? Hmm. Okay. Uh, mm mm mm. Oh, they got the fucking thing on them. They got the fucking symbols on them. Hmm. Okay, well that doesn't tell me which is which though. Oh, rock pattern. Okay. So rock, steel, rock, steel, ice. Okay. Okay, rock, steel, ice. Let's do that. Alright. Rock. Steel. Ice. There we go. Nice and done. Yeah, after you figure out how to actually do the damn pedal right. Yeah, yeah. Gotta solve the stones, just figure out what the fuck I'm doing. Aha! That is one of these damn things. Alright. Alright, let's see. He's looking that way. Okay. Alright, ice. Uh-oh. Ice, rock. Ice, rock, steel. Ice, rock, steel. Uh-oh. There's more. Steel. Oh, fuck me. Ice, rock, steel. Rock. Okay, hold on. Uh, shit. Ice. Rock. Steel. Rock. Ice. Oh, memory, you served me well. And I did not write that down, but I think if there's going to be more, I'm definitely writing it down. I do not care. I'm not going to remember that much. Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God. Is there, is there... Oh, my God, there is one way over here. Why? Fuck it, I'm, I'm putting... I'm writing it down. I'm not fucking 
doing this. Okay, what was this one? Okay. Steel. I don't give a shit. I'm gonna cheat. It's not actually it's not cheating, it's actually being resourceful. Okay. Steel, ice, and what we got here? Rock. Okay, that's looking. Fuck. Okay. And it's looking this way. Then it's ice again. Okay. I'm being smart, folks. Don't worry. Okay. And then this is steel. Okay. This is rock. Okay. I got it. Let's do it. All right. So what I wrote down. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, rock. There we go. Okay, unless they're gonna give me another one, please don't. Nope, I think we're done. You better hope so. Yeah, or else this one's gonna be a very long one. Hope not. Oh, there's a Rolt up here. There's a Gallade in here. Oh, Jesus. Great. Just what we fucking need. Really, I need to catch this thing over here. So it doesn't alert the other one. Nice shot. Whew. I'm surprised how well that went. See, his friend just realized, like, oh shit, he's gone. Turn around. Good love of God, turn around, you bastard. Turn around, turn around, it's good. Everything's good. Oh, don't, don't see me. Don't see me. Yeah! Nice. Woo! That's right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Science, man. How the hell you do that? You just, you just nail the timing and you can just instantly just keep throwing those Pokeballs at him. There we go. Nice. I didn't care if I missed or didn't catch him or not. It's just like, gotta make sure I can get through. Papa, is that her? I think so. Yeah, it's her. Fucking gotcha, you little girl. Oh. I guess I've been caught. See, we, we're nearly done. That's no fun. Hey, remember my clairvoyance? It showed me something. I saw you flying with Braviary. Do you think that will come to pass? I'll make sure it does. Well, however the future turns out, flying with Braviary isn't easy. If you really want to be able to fly high in the sky, prove to me you're strong enough. <sighs> Gonna take us on? Yep. Now get ready, because here come Rhyperior, Magmortar, and Electivire. All three of them. Go! That's such bullshit, you know? It really is. Like, why the fuck? Uh, like, why the fuck all three of them at once? It's like, why can't I, like, throw out my three? I got all. Alright, strong style. Take out that Rhyperior. You might end up going down to Sijuai, but that's fine. And it's fine. Because I gotta take out one at a time, sadly. Hmm. Damn. Damn! How do you survive that? Oh, there's 30s. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. They're level 30s. What was I thinking? Good job, Decidueye. Good job. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Alright. Oh shit, I got rid of my rep. Ah, oh, fuck, I'm an idiot. Rap. So much for that. Eh, yeah. Can't really throw you out because you would just die. If I do yeah, fuck. Okay, whatever. Go! Gudra! It's a Gudra! Hyper pump! Hydro pump! Not hyper pump. Hydro pump. There we go. Yeah, no. No. 
They can't touch this. No, no. Dragon Pulse this. There. What was the point of that one? I have no clue, Chippy. I was just doing what I was doing. I need to get myself a magma water, though. Hmm. There we go. Now heal my Pokemon. Wow, you caught us and you beat us. You won all of our games so far. But Bravier still wants to get to know you even better. Up to the roof we go. God almighty, how much more, girl? We're trying to do the stupid fucking... The, the Lord. I mean, at least there's the ending over there. Yeah, but is it gonna be fine, though? I mean, we should be fine. I mean, we should, yeah. We, should, we definitely should be fine. But you never know, because if it's going to be like a fight against Braviary, we got the Electivire. <sighs> oh, <laughs> I was like, what's stopping me? I missed a mime! Is it you stopping me again? No, there's freaking Braviary, Jesus Christ. Oh, way up there. Holy crap. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, Jesus. Okay, what's the point of that little area? I don't know either, but better not fall off and freaking make your way back up there again. Yeah, sounds like a yeah. Sounds like a smart idea there, Zook. <laughs> oh good. Okay. Easy, birdie. Easy. Alright, Brave Eerie. Why not test out Scourge's strength for yourself? Yeah, figure that was gonna be a battle there. Go, Electivire. I think you caught it. Yep. Never know. Yeah, level 54, like it should be. Thunder! Shit. Oof. God damn, like, how the hell are these Pokemon so strong? Thunderbolt, please. That takes care of that. Oh. I can't believe Braviary lost. But that's that. Thanks for playing with me. Guess I'll head home now. Bye. Wait. I was kidding. Play along with me on your flute. All right. Got it. <gasps> Even though it's the same fucking song, but hey, whatever. Alright, cool. Huh? Oh, Skyplay. Nice. How many of those do you have now? I have no idea. Oh, thanks, Savvy. <laughs> Zobby, yeah. Sure, having Scourge to fly around with, with should be fun for a Braviary. Yeah, I'm glad. A world where people and Pokemon live and work together, huh? Tell me, why do you think that lightning comes from the rift would cause these frenzies? Do you think this is Almighty's anger? Or do you think this is a trial it's putting out to us? If it is if ourselves worthy, and we quell the last noble called Malvalog, then the rift really ought to close, right? Even if it, the one who seems to be clearing this trial is a newcomer like you, not one of us who've been living here in history for ages now. How come you're playing all wise? I thought you weren't a big thinker, Diamond. Hush, Sabi. I can feel history on the move. As far as I can see, the one ushering in this new era is you. So if I stick with you someday, I might get to meet Almighty Sinnoh and myself. The question is, does listening to Diamond fascinate you, or bore you to tears, hmm? Anyway, Scourge, it's time for you to go soar with Braviary. If you jump from way up here, Braviary can take you gliding just about anywhere. Wait, are we talking about gliding, or are we actually flying to place to place? Okay. But don't forget 
to get the internal ice. That's why you need Braviary in the first place, right? Ah, uh, sure, I guess. <clears> How <throat> Log's legacy is down there. Hmm. Now, go get a feel for flying with Braviary. When you're done soaring the skies and want to land, just ask him to dive. Oh, okay. Yay. Dive, dive, dive. Uh huh. With Brave Air, you can fly high up into the skies and explore the different areas of Hisui from the air. You can summon Brave Air with plus, okay. Press A if you're falling from some height to summon him in a flash. <laughs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh, there we go. <laughs> What the hell were you thinking? I wasn't. Alright then. And I can fly. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. I think about it every night and day. I spread my wings and fly away. I believe I can soar. I think about it through it up and up. I believe I can fly. Oh god. Mayday, mayday. Going down high. Going down high. Whoa. Nailed it. Let's investigate this. Hmm. Huh? Wow, actually, it's been a while since that phone was beeping. Well, what did it say? Piece of eternal ice. Oh, thanks. Huh? Ah, oh, well, look at him. At last, the summit is conquered. And I see you made it too. Flew down to this place and obtained the eternal ice, did you? What drives that burning zeal of yours, I wonder? I don't know, man. There you go. I do have to respect the effort you put in. I may still have my own doubts weighing on my mind, but I will make the necessary preparations so that you can face my Lord Avalog. Meet me at Ice Peak Arena. You got it. But fix your chest hair first. No, I'm good. Now don't try to repeat the wondrous feat you're about to see me perform. A total leap like this one can only be managed by highly toned bodies like mine. Till we meet, meet next meet. Yeah, I don't care. Woohoo! I'm kind of a server nerd. Sure. Uh, oh, I can only glide to a certain point. Can I? Can I go up? Like I want to go up. Hmm. So really, you got like a certain height, so you can't go up. So you just gotta make do. There's something, I don't know. Who the heck is up here? Oh, Volo and him. Why, if it isn't Scourge. What a pleasure, finding a familiar face. Or any face in this far corner of the Alabaster Islands. I came to bring Garrick an order of sword caps. And he was more than willing to have a chat about Avalog. What do you say? Interested in a bit of gossip? Sure, I guess. And why wouldn't you be? So Avalog, yes, the fifth of Hisui's nobles. That he is, and you know what? He's an absolute beast. Well, yes, according to what I was told, not only does he barrage you with chunks of ice, he also fires off massive icicles, and he can cause sharp ice crystals to erupt from the ground below you. Doesn't that seem a bit too powerful to take on? What's more, apparently Avalog of old could be up to a hundred feet tall. Doesn't that seem a bit too big to take on? Oh, you'll be alright. You just have to eat some sword caps, and give your training... You're all 
Nothing better than for build, building muscle than that. Oh, we're now to the arena. Hmm, well, yes, I did want But perhaps not at the cost of my life. So I suppose my freezing digits, I will be off. And I will be, yeah. Wow. Sometimes, like, now I stop pausing myself and just, like, yeah. Like, do it right, read it right, huh? Hi. Yeah, that, that is actually horrible. You have to be at the tallest point where you can actually just fly around. Like, he actually glides. Huh. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I realize I'm about to face Avalog. No, no, no. no ah, whoa! <laughs> wow, fun times I can throw that! No kidding, Jesus. Alright, hi, buddy. Whew. Oh, we are to quell Avalog as you wished in the end. The strength of your feelings won out. Or maybe your real strength comes from the way that you walk among po Pokemon and people. That's not the way around. No one cares, Chippy. Well, I suppose I better get to work making some bombs using that. Learn how they are made with muscles like mine beyond moment's work. Yup! <laughs> There you have it. If you truly wish to quell Avalog, then walk on. The path lies before you. But know that Avalog will hurl chunks of ice at you without relent. You'll need an unrivaled dodging ability. I'm going. Don't stop me. Can't stop me now. Oh my god. <laughs> right, Avalog, where are you? Is he, oh, is he standing on top of him? No. Okay, maybe not. Holy shit! Oh my god! Holy fuckeroony! Look at the size of that fucker! Oh my god! They weren't joking about how big this fucker is! Okay, hi friend! Wait, what? Oh shit, yeah, he's like, he's like really far away. Huh. Wow, those guys are gonna dodge just fine. Ugh. This is the legit freaking size area is a little hard. Whoa! Whoa, dearie. Whoa! There you go, bitch. Oh shit! Woo! Yeah. Got our money. What are you gonna do, man? What do you mean? What I gotta do? Whoa! I just like how the hell I can just go through freaking lasers like that shit. All right, go freaking. Nope, too late. Come on. Come on, freaking shoot, throw shit at him. Uh, yeah, again, I'm not sure how the hell that works, but I'll take it. I just like how invulnerable works when you get to dodge. Not like you're a freaking, I don't know, champion in the making. Oh, Jesus! Holy crap, get out of there! Oh my god! Here comes the icicle strikes. Oh, well, uh, uh, come on, here comes that laser, whoop, go, freaking, the uh, freaking incineroar, I just realized this is a dumb idea, how so, because it's part rock, Oh crap, he's right. Yeah. Because I just actually evolved one of my own. Oh wow, actually, did not. That didn't do bad. Hmm. 
great agile style. Earth power, shit! Infernape! Here comes a friggin' power style. Or regular earth power, goddamn. Infernape, no! Papa! Oh, friggin' goddamn, that did well. Oh, I guess. Yeah. Don't you fucking run! Get your ass back here! Ah, oh, seriously! Get up! Get over here, jerk! Don't you run from me! Oh, God. I mean, he's not that hard to beat. Wait, is there something, like, actually... No, he ain't... He has the same moves as I was, like, expecting, like, maybe more. Ow. So hard to judge at that fucking distance. Come on, you bastard. Holy shit. What the fuck? What the fuck happened? I had the bastard. What the shit was that? Tell it out, little. Will you be killer? Just throw that shit. Oh, dear God. <laughs> throw that bomb. There it goes, there's the last fucking thing. Still a weird fucking Pokemon you are. There you go, everybody. Everyone's level up. Huh. Um, okay. <laughs> Whatever. Thanks for the plate. Oh, man. Garrick, sir, you didn't look so... You, you needn't look quite so downcast. But seeing mighty Alvagua quilled, Avalog quilled, and by such a slight child, a child that fell from the very sky, is this Scourge boy some kind of monster in disguise? He is no monster. He's the one who risked his life without a second thought in order to quell our frenzied, suffering nobles. Scourge. Garrick cares for the Pearl Clan with all his heart and believes in Almighty Sinnoh just as deeply. So he has fear for any of us that getting involved with the Diamond Clan and your Galaxy Team will cause our people to flag in their devotion to Almighty Sinnoh. But that will change. Pearl. I know your fears will change once you see what I've seen. Scourge has much to teach us. He's shown us how we can overcome all manner of strife, so long as our Pokemon are with us. He's made me want to help Galaceon realize greater strength as well, and to see my whole world grow broader. It seems you already changed, Pearl. I knew you could pull that off, Scourge. Quelled every last frenzied noble. So, is that space time rift going to start closing up now, or what? There's a little way of knowing for sure, though this rift does seem perhaps a little smaller somehow. Let's hope so, anyway. Well, with any luck, things will settle down now. Although, even if the rift does start spitting out more of that strange lightning. We should still be all right, as long as we got... Indeed, we should be. It's good to have him at our side. Whose side? You know something, Pearl? We may never agree on who got it right about Almighty Sinnoh, but you Pearl clan folk aren't all bad in my book. Look who's finally seen reason. Anyway, now that we quelled the last noble... I say we pay grim old Commander Kamado Ka a visit, and see if he'll find a crack a smile for us. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I'm not in the Yeah, I don't think that fucker's gonna do anything. But we will get out of here. Well, let's do it. Oh, lordy.
Who's a new one? Oh god, my freaking arm. Oh. There we go. Oh, come on, I was so close. I want to be rank 8, motherfucker. Rank 8! Ugh. <laughs> oh. I mean, this, this is getting harder to do it now. It really is, but. It could have make sense. I would figure it, like the rank ten would be like, oh, you caught every single Pokemon. That's my guess. What'd you got? Lightning bolt rock? Sure, why not? Oh, lightning bolt rock. You fucking idiot. It's a thunderstone. <laughs> a lightning bolt rock. I love them. I love them bastards. Okay. Oh, God, there's more requests. Oh, no. All right. Uh, home of the East, Snow White, Vulpix on the snow? Hmm. Oh, fine. Ooh, you could be right about that one. Several has calls and Kate. What? Un oh, unless they're talking about, like, maybe... Mm, unless they're talking about the Zora that I found off screen. I mean, the fact that you've seen a lot of Pokemon off screen. True, and evolved into a Zorok as well, so. <laughs> I've seen a lot of things off screen. <clears throat> each of the Pokemon nobles have become frenzied, and now each of them has been quelled. We still have no explanation for why this calamity befell us, but I'm glad to see it put into an end. And to think peace would be restored to Hisui by the hand of the mysterious Riftborn Helper. When tomorrow dawns, it will be done on a new, and a world restored to normalcy. At long last, we will be able to return to our noble lives. Go nourish your flower, and allow yourself a good long rest. Don't forget, the Survey Corps' work is not over. It does not end until our people can live here in history without fearing the Pokemon around us. Yes, sir. Fuck. No, we're, we're actually. Oh, damn it! I was hoping we skipped the potato mochi shit! Oh. My mom's bringing out, yeah, huh? Get out of here, mm-hmm. Having the nobles all quelled puts a grave threat to rest. Now it's time we focus on our survey work. Though we still can't let our guard down around. Regular wild Pokemon, of course. I certainly have reservations as to whether Avalon needed quelling. But it seems bringing him calm to everyone. Then I suppose we did everything right. Yeah, someone might have been around under attack by some frenzied noble this very moment if Scourge sky to us. I still wonder though, just what is the space-time rift anyway? And what will it make it finally go? Wait, if the rift were to vanish, would that leave Scourge stranded here? I guess so. Well, our little team is currently very practiced at investigating things by now. We'll look into the matter and find a solution, I have no doubt. And even if we don't, you always have a home here in Jubilife Village, Scourge. But that means no Nintendo, no Pokemon. Um, the love in the Pokemon world, dummy. Oh, yeah. Now then, tomorrow's soon upon us. And I'll be another hard day at work for the Survey Corps. Don't forget we got our sights on nothing less than a completed Pokedex. That's right, we'll get it done. With Scourge in the lead and me as a Valiant assistant. Assistant? Come on now, Kari. Don't sell yourself short. You're a full-fledged member of the Survey Corps, too. Well, thanks for that, Professor. 
"Then I guess I'd better eat my fill and get plenty of energy for another long day tomorrow." Yeah, yeah. But I mean, what else is there? We saved all the nervous. Oh, I'm sure there's something more. Like, I'm sure we have to deal with, like, maybe Dialga, Palkia, maybe Arceus. The fuck was that? Like, I just barely heard the damn audio from the TV. Disaster looming. <laughs> oh, that sounds like fun. Yeah. Great! I love the sound of that. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's put those away. Put you away. Put you away. I'm gonna put you away. Okay, what else we got here? <laughs> yeah, don't need you. <laughs> oh, like, there's no point in a lot of this stuff. Uh, I need the ice stone. For maybe Eevee. Yeah, Eevee should make the Glaceon, because I need that. I actually need fucking Leafeon, too, I believe. I don't know. Uh oh Oh, shit! Papa! What the hell do we do now? Scourge. Yeah, I heard. Ah, oh, shit, that'll get bigger! Oh, boy. I don't like his luck. Yeah, I don't like it either. Some sort of dreadful energy seems to be pouring out from the rift in space time thing. Now the entire sky has got red! Have word from the commander. You report to his office at once. Oh, yes, ma'am. I think we're in trouble. <clears throat> the way the sky has changed, it is ominous. Very ominous indeed. What's this about, Commander? You did call us to discuss the quelling of all the nobles, didn't you? That can wait. There is more pressing concern here that we must address. The first strike of the strange lightning, the one that drove Cleaver into a frenzy. It struck the night that Scourge fell from the sky, did it not? It only seems natural that I think the two events might be linked in some way. Ah, shit. Who or what are you, are you really, Scourge? A Survey Corps member? Indeed, you've done all I ordered. But that does not answer the question of who you really are. You came from the Rift, as did the Lightning. You're connected to these frenzies, are you not? Did you think you can? Did you think to gain our trust by quelling the frenzies yourself you brought about, and have gained our trust? That what then? What is that? Is it that you're really after? I'm not. I'm just an innocent guy, man. Hold on, Commander. There's nothing to suggest Scourge has wronged us. Exactly. And besides, do you really think he's got the sort of fearsome power? it takes to make all this happen. Let me ask you in turn, can you prove beyond a doubt that he is free from guilt? This person, the stranger, appeared out of a rift in space-time. Who here can guarantee he is who he says? Who can guarantee he is to be trusted? But that's... No one can do that. You're asking us to prove a negative. How is anyone supposed to prove the absence of all doubt? Come on, let's be reasonable. What is Scourge supposed to do then? He will be given a chance to investigate this. But not as a member of the Galaxy team. He remains as a suspect until he is clear of his name. There are those in the village who cannot trust a stranger like you who fell from the sky. And so I must ask you to leave. You are no longer welcome in the team Galaxy team. Consider yourself banished from this village until you can explain 
why these calamities keep befalling our good people. No, until you restored our will to its rightful state, and proven your innocence beyond doubt. Is that clear, C? Yes, sir. How can you act so heartless? Don't you believe in Scourge? Do not attempt to intervene on his behalf. I will do what I must to command as the commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. But I have not forgotten, forgotten your deeds, nor the unusual skill you have displayed. That is why I have chosen to let, to let you walk out of here free rather than clap you in the chains. Jesus Christ! What the fuck, man? After all we've done for you! Seriously, go! Fuck yourself! <clears throat> You're going to be expelled? Well, but why? Orders are orders. Well... Let's go. Bye, guys! This is so stupid! Scary. Oh my god, they're actually gonna talk about us? Yeah, girl, I'm sorry. Can it really be true? What the fuck? Oh my god! What the hell? This is like some fucked up shit. How could anyone do such a thing? God damn. Yeah, but guys, I'm not. I'm. I didn't. I just fell from the sky. We can take it from here, ma'am. Understood. However, the decision was mine to accept this stranger as a member of the Survey Corps. It is only right that I should personally escort him from the village and to the field lance camp. I'll also see him off. As well I, naturally. I will allow it. Then I'll mark you all down. Lands camp. Safe travels. This is fucking bullshit! Oh, man. I mean, now what? Now, now pr pretty much, he is screwed. He's out on his own. I can't believe the boss would do this. You were acting on your on his own orders when you quelled the frenzy nobles. Why right, right. Moreover, bleh. moreover, bleh, God damn it. Why right, right. Moreover, even if you did happen to fall from the sky, that hardly gives you the power to turn it red. That is utterly intolerable, and I might add absurdly unscientific scientific. <laughs> Yeah, as I am a science, I must f fight such illogical thinking tooth and nail. You must not. You will only cause Scourge more pain if you are driven out as well for defending him. However, there are others who might offer help. You've been an aide to both Diamond and P Pearl Clan. Of course! Perhaps Pearl and Diamond can take you in. Well, I'm afraid they both already returned to their perceptive back. Yeah, um, whatever. Perhaps you could try to find Elian first. He's likely in the... Don't die alone out there. That's an order. I will ensure you have all you need to complete the survey the commander he has asked tasked you with. If I might offer my advice... In this life, you will meet both admiration and abuse from others. How others choose to view you is a choice only they can make. You cannot make it for them. All that truly matters is that you hold firm to your own values. What of the dream I first shared with you on the Prelude Beach to complete the Pokedex? That dream simply won't come true without you. Yeah. That's a... Crazy, man. No kidding. What the hell are you supposed to do? Well, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna end the episode. Cause right now, the I fucking Christ. 
It's just like, holy crap, the cr like, I think we're getting near to the end, boys. Oh, man. Well, good luck, man. Yeah, we'll see. So until then, my fellow gargoyles, see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Motherfuckers.